Hello everyone and welcome to another edition of MSW Weekly Update. I'm your host, the MSW World Heavyweight Champion and the owner of MSW, The Clinic. Well, our next event is going to be MSW Mid-South Mania 2. And we have decided on our most likely date for this event to be the weekend of March 20th and 21st, the weekend before WWE's WrestleMania 26. So the weekend before WrestleMania 26, you can enjoy MSW Mid-South Mania 2. And we already know one huge match for this event, as the kid will defend the GWA World Backyard Wrestling Championship against Derek Knight. Both of these men are former MSW World Heavyweight Champions. Both of these men have come up, uh, you know, through the years in backyard wrestling together. So this should definitely be a classic match. And last week we brought you a, a preview of their match at MCW Mania back in 2008, and that match will be hitting YouTube soon. But there have been so many other matches uh, over the past couple of years in which these two have been a part of against each other and as a tag team. They came in together as a tag team, the Phenomenal Angels, and won the MSW World Tag Team Championship in their debut of them. And they dominated the tag team ranks until Derek Knight... Uh, due to, I guess we call it personal issues, actually quit Backyard Wrestling and vacated the MSW World Heavyweight Championship. And upon Derek Knight's return, uh, he had a brief return, and then he came back again at MSW Action last year in June of 2009. And at the end of that event, a very uh, shocking uh, a very shocking event took place as the kid actually turned on Derek Knight. And the kid injured Derek Knight so severely that he was out for several months, but now Derek Knight is back in action. And the two tried to put their differences aside back in November at MSW Starcade 2009 Tradition Defended, and they actually teamed up in an MSW World Tag Team Championship match. And after their loss, Derek Knight turned the tables and turned on the kid with the help of his new associate, Josh Rampage. And these two have been the team. Uh, Derek Knight and Josh Rampage have become a tag team. And in fact, in GWA Inaugural Ball 2009, the kid took, uh, took on Josh Rampage one-on-one, -on -one and the kid picked up the victory. So now the kid must move on to Derek Knight, who won a battle royal, for a shot at the kid's title. So what will happen when these two meet for the GWA World Backyard Wrestling Championship the weekend of March 20th and 21st at MSW Mid-South Mania? Anything can happen. We've seen that in MSW and when the GWA World Backyard Wrestling Championship is on the line, the stakes are higher than they have ever been before for these two. No disqualifications except in the case of outside interference, and these two have a 60-minute time limit in which to wrestle. And they're going to need it because these two have always been matched uh, so evenly, so head-to-head -head over the past couple of years. So uh, very equal in a lot of ways. And though the kid has uh, had more stability and been able to build up more experience, you can never count Derek Knight out. He defeated several other people to win that battle royal last month. And he is on his way to definitely putting up a great challenge for the kids' GWA World Backyard Wrestling Championship. And coming soon, you'll be able to watch their classic one-on-one -on -one encounter from NCW Mania in March 2008 for the MSW World Heavyweight Championship. And in the meantime, you can see many other classic matches involving these two on our YouTube channel, as well as our latest event, GWA Inaugural Ball 2010, When Worlds Collide. And in the meantime, we'll see you here next week on MSW Weekly Update.